East of Eden, by John Steinbeck is a sweeping and ambitious novel that spans generations and explores themes of good and evil, morality, family, and the search for identity. Set in California's Salinas Valley, the story weaves together the destinies of two families, the Trasks and the Hamiltons, as they grapple with their intertwined histories and the timeless struggle between darkness and light. The novel opens with the introduction of two parallel narratives. The first centers around the Hamilton family, particularly Samuel Hamilton and his descendants. Samuel, an Irish immigrant, settles in the Salinas Valley in the late 19th century and becomes a respected and wise figure in the community. His large and diverse family, including his children and grandchildren, provides a counterpoint to the Trask family story and embodies values of hard work, community, and empathy. The second narrative follows the Trask family, primarily focusing on Adam Trask and his brother, Charles. Raised by their stern and emotionally distant father, Cyrus Trask, the brothers have a strained relationship from childhood. Charles harbors deep resentment toward Adam, believing that his father loved Adam more. The arrival of Kathy Ames, a mysterious and manipulative woman, further complicates their lives. Kathy marries Adam but later abandons him and the twin sons, Aaron and Cal, leaving a trail of deceit and destruction in her wake. As the Trask brothers grow, they take divergent paths. Aaron becomes the embodiment of virtue and idealism, while Cal struggles with feelings of inadequacy and a dark temperament inherited from his mother. Adam, seeking a fresh start, moves the family to Salinas and becomes involved with Samuel Hamilton and his family. The narrative unfolds against the backdrop of California's evolving landscape, with themes of agricultural progress and the changing dynamics of land ownership and labor relations. The intertwined lives of the Trasks and Hamiltons mirror the larger shifts in American society during the late 19th and early 20th centuries. A pivotal moment in the novel occurs when Kathy, now operating under the alias, Kate, returns to the Salinas Valley as the Madam of a Brothel. Her reappearance sets in motion a series of tragic events, including Aaron's disillusionment and enlistment in World War I. The discovery of Kathy's true identity by Cal, who is now determined to protect his father from the painful truth, leads to a dramatic confrontation and revelation. The novel's title, East of Eden, references the biblical story of Cain and Abel, symbolizing the eternal struggle between good and evil. Cal grapples with the belief that he is inherently evil, a sentiment exacerbated by his father's favoritism toward Aaron. Ultimately, the novel explores whether individuals are predestined to repeat the sins of their ancestors or if they have the power to choose their own destinies. The climax of the novel occurs when Adam, devastated by the truth about Kathy and Aaron's death in the war, falls into a catatonic state. Cal, who has long sought his father's approval, embarks on a journey of redemption and self-discovery, attempting to make amends for his perceived sins. East of Eden concludes with a message of hope and the possibility of redemption as Cal makes a selfless gesture toward his father, offering Adam a gift of lettuce. This act symbolizes the potential for forgiveness and the capacity to transcend one's inherent flaws. John Steinbeck's East of Eden is a profound exploration of the human condition, the struggle between good and evil, and the power of choice and redemption. Through its rich character development and sweeping narrative, the novel delves into the complexities of human relationships and the enduring quest for meaning and identity. East of Eden remains a timeless and thought-provoking work of literature that continues to resonate with readers today. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe for other interesting book summaries to spice up your to-be-read list.